clients that have found out that their cell phone was being used to track them by an ex-husband or uh, an abuser that they're trying to escape. Well, the same technology that allows 911 to find you in an emergency can lead a stalker to your precise location. Curtis J shows how the technology is leading local women and organizations to make changes to keep safe. You send a text, you make a call, you travel. The details can silently be sent to a third party without you knowing it. So how does this happen? It turns out there's an app for that. Technology. It's here to help and put you in danger. All over the country, reports of stalkers getting their victims unknowingly by simply using a cell phone. Suddenly he broke into her apartment. She didn't know how he found her, but... Given what's going on technologically, you just never know anymore. Sharon Katz works with women daily who tell her stories of falling victim to high-tech stalking, stories where stalkers see their every move, when they're online, who they're talking with, their exact location at all times. We had a uh, client who went in to get her car uh, serviced, and the mechanic said, do you know you have a GPS device down here under the car? And she had no idea. Most disturbing, her lifeline was his invisible leash. Several clients that have found out that their cell phone was being used to track them by an ex-husband or uh, an abuser that they're trying to escape. High-tech stalking is now putting local abuse shelters where Sharon works at risk. It is happening here and everywhere. Women die. I mean, women die, and for those women that do end up in the morgue, they are usually in the process of leaving. In Arizona, Lori Latif was leaving. Her husband, Andre, accused of shooting their two young children before turning the gun on himself. He survived. The kids did not. And in Washington, James Harrison killed his kids, then himself, after stalking his wife. Both men used the GPS in their wives' cell phones. Want to know where your kids are right now? AT&T markets a family map service as a safety tool to whoever is paying the bill. From a web browser or another phone, it displays a very accurate GPS fix with the map and satellite view. If the target is indoors, Family Map determines their rough coordinates using the nearest cell tower. It's just amazing how people can be found now. Police use GPS to track criminals, but they have to get a warrant or a signed release. A husband paying the bill needs no such authorization to track his wife, even if they're separated. Turning off the phone does not disable GPS tracking. That's why it is so important to take out the battery and SIM card. For other safety tips regarding GPS and stalking, go to NBCActionNews.com and click on Lifestyle. For NBC Action News, Curtis J.